This one's called a snap tee. And I'm going to be making a 45 degree change of direction with it. I'm facing the target 45 degrees across, okay? Lift, like I do with any other spay cast. Lift, I'm going to bring the rod into the centre of the river and snap across. Swing round and make my forward delivery. That's the snap T, 45 degrees. Let's look at that in detail. We're going to lift, and instead of bringing the rod up here, like I might do with a backhanded double spay, for instance, I'm going to bring the rod tip into the river. I'm going to draw a line from here to there. I'm going to do an inclined sweep like we know, but when the rod gets to here, I'm going to snap underneath it. I'm going to draw this shape, a snap underneath it. And imagine you've got a pulley wheel. Let me show you. You've got a pulley wheel there. You see that snap underneath? Imagine you've come around the top of the pulley and as you come around the side and the bottom of the pulley, you're going to accelerate and snap. And I'm going to bring the rod tip back to where it started. Reposition to show. Facing the target. Into the bank, snap under, swing round, make the forward delivery. That is called the snap T. Here we are, downstream, rod tip on the water, lift up, bring it into the middle of the water, snap under. And you see that my anchor went up there, a rod length away. And that's where we want it. We want the tip of the line, a rod length away, just off our casting shoulder. And after we've done that, we know that it's around the spiral staircase, watch the running mouse make our forward delivery. Show you again. Lift, snap, spiral staircase, running mouse, forward delivery. Simple, isn't it? Once you start putting all the building blocks, which is the smooth lift, the inclined sweep, the snap, the spiral staircase climbing, watch the running mouse make the forward delivery. We're using our eyes and ears all the time. When I say using our ears, another way to know when to make the forward delivery is that you can hear the running mouse. And then at the end, just there, you heard a little blub, blub, blub. And what that is, it's the tip of the line turning to face the direction. And when it turns, it drags a bit of air in it and makes these bubbles. And you can hear this blub, 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 blub. And that is another great way there to know when to make the forward delivery. Perfect. 45 degree snap tee.